Hello everyone! Today for Art at Home with Miss Lipscomb, we're starting in Pond Life Week. So we're going to work on a pond project. We're going to talk about Claude Monet, who is a famous artist who is known for his pond paintings. He's very good at them, and so I really want to pay homage to his projects. Here are a few paintings that he's worked on. And this is what we're going to be working on today. It's kind of a 3D project, so it's going to be very fun and it's going to turn out really, really, really nice. So for this project, you're going to need a light blue and a dark blue piece of paper. You're also going to need a green piece of paper. You're going to need a pink and red piece of paper. You're going to need scissors that you will use with the parent. And you're also going to need a black marker and you will also need glue. It's best to work with hot glue for this project and you should probably have some hot glue sticks on the side. We're going to start with our blue piece of paper, our black marker, and we're going to draw a circle. Now this circle does not have to be perfect. It can be all over the place because it wants, we want to represent a pond. So go ahead and take your green paper and you're going to cut a small piece of that paper off, just like you see me doing here. Next we're going to take our pond that we drew and we're going to cut out around the black line. When you finish cutting along the black line, you can go ahead and add your glue and glue it onto the green piece of paper that we cut. Next, go ahead and take that strip of green that you cut out and you're going to fold that three times. After you fold them, you can go ahead and grab your scissors that you will use with the parent and cut a circle out. These are going to be the lily pads. You should have four of them. Next, take your scissors and cut a slice out of those green circles. It should look like a Pac-Man with a little mouth. Next, you're going to take your hot glue and glue a small dot onto the lily pad. It's important that you only do a dot. Don't glue the entire thing because we're going to have this lily pad come up off of the water so that it gives a 3D effect. Repeat that step for all of them. And then you're going to go around each lily pad and lift up the sides. That way it looks like this. Repeat that step for all of your lily pads. Next we're going to work on little waves that go through the water. You're going to take your light blue paper and on the edge of it draw a scooped line shape. Go ahead and cut them out and they should look like this when you cut them out. Go ahead and take your glue and you can go ahead and glue a line and then attach your small waves onto that glue. Repeat that step until all of your glue is on. And there you should have it. Next, take your pink and red paper and cut a very small strip out of that. Then cut that strip into four little pieces. Take one small strip of red and one small strip of pink and you're going to ball them up. You're going to glue each one onto a green lily pad. And repeat this step for all of your lily pads. And there you go. Your pond.
great job today, guys. I will see you tomorrow for Art at Home with Miss Lipscomb.